What's up guys? This is Chris from DraftDashboard.com. Here are my picks for MLB Saturday, July 6th. These picks apply for DraftKings and FanDuel. Before I get started, please drop a like on this video and hit that red subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you don't miss our new videos. In this video, I'm going to go over my top picks for today's MLB slate. And if you stick around to the very end of this video, we'll use the Draft Dashboard tools to make a DFS lineup using the picks we just made. Okay guys, this is for the main slate tonight. At pitcher, I like Chris Bassett with a 2% pitching advantage over the Seattle Mariners. Chris Bassett throws really well versus lefty and righties, only giving up a .656 OPS to lefties, and he's facing six lefties tonight. On top of that, the Mariners are only batting a 263 batting average versus Chris Bassett. So I like Chris Bassett here versus the Seattle Mariners. Okay guys, it's time to announce the winner of our $100 weekly comment contest. And the winner is... Andrew Boudreau! Andrew Boudreau, you are the winner of this week's $100 comment contest. Please reply to our comment to collect your prize. Just a quick note to the winner, YouTube no longer allows you to post your email address in the comments. So you can reply with your Twitter name and we'll contact you on Twitter to collect your prize. Before I continue with the picks, I'm excited today because we added a new contest for everyone watching. If you want to enter the drawing for $100 PayPal, all you need to do is like this video, hit that subscribe button, and make a quick comment below to be entered into the drawing. We'll reply to a random comment and let you know that you won, and then we'll send you $100 PayPal. So it's that easy, and we pick a new winner every Saturday and announce them in our video. So get your comment in now so I can add another entry for you. Okay, who do we have at the second base position? I like Cesar Hernandez with a 32% batting advantage over Noah Syndergaard. Cesar Hernandez bats 12% better versus righty pitchers, and Noah Syndergaard throws his worst ball by far to switch hitters, 20% worse than his other pitches. On top of that, Cesar Hernandez is batting 10 for 25. That's a 400 batting average and a .883 OPS versus Syndergaard. So I like Cesar Hernandez here versus Noah Syndergaard. Real quick guys, I got great news. For a limited time, we're offering a full 30 day trial to Draft Dashboard. You can try all of our DFS tools for all sports. You can try the position optimizer where you can see the top players ranked for each position. And we added a new player trends tool where you can see the top salary differences between FanDuel and DraftKings. It's a really good tool to help you pick out value for the site that you're playing on. Oh, and if you're tired of doing research every day, we just added a cheat sheet that shows hand-picked plays for the slate. No confusing stat lines, no headaches, just a simple cheat sheet that shows the absolute best players for your lineups. Okay, who do we have at the shortstop position? This is a money saver here. I like Brandon Crawford with a 34% batting advantage over a low salary pitcher, Miles Mikolas. Brandon Crawford bats a little bit better versus righty pitchers, and Miles Mikolas throws his worst ball by far to lefty batters, 33% worse than his other pitches. And Brandon Crawford is two for three with a 1.166 OPS versus Mikolas. So I like Brandon Crawford as a nice value play here versus Miles Mikolas. Okay, who do we have at the outfield position? I like Jeff McNeil with a 29% batting advantage over a low salary pitcher, Jake Arrieta. Jeff McNeil bats a little bit better versus righty pitchers, and Jake Arrieta throws his worst ball to lefty batters, 28% worse than his other pitches, giving up a .895 OPS to lefties. And Jeff McNeil is batting a 588 batting average. He's 10 for 17 with a 1.412 OPS versus Arrieta. So I like Jeff McNeil here versus Jake Arietta. If you want to try all these daily fantasy tools for yourself, click the link in the description below this video or just go to draftdashboard.com. You can use our DFS lineup optimizer to build quality lineups 
using our picks and your own custom player pool. Click the link in the description below this video and try all these daily fantasy tools right now. Thanks so much for watching. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit that bell icon so you can get instant updates whenever we post a new video. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed this video, please smickety smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Oh, and please comment below with your favorite player for this MLB slate. I love to hear what you guys have to think. Thanks again and good luck.